Hello everyone, welcome back to Cuboid Outpost. So, last episode we set up a bit of Tinker's stuff. Uh, hopefully we've got... Wait, which way is it? Uh, this way. Okay, still coming in. We've got some lava going right now. Um, yeah, we kind of need to wait for the lava. I'm going to go set this... Oh, actually no we don't. We can set this up right here with, I think we need the basin, yeah. And I need to make another one of these. That goes in like that. I need some, something to burn, so let's grab some of that. And let's put some copper in here. So we are, oh yeah. <laughs> we are basically skipping this entire stage because we already have copper. And whilst, we go, whilst that cooks up. Uh, I think it's like... Is it this one? Drain. Yeah, we just need a drain. We don't need the chute. What we can do is pour this copper over the melter. Let that cook up. And now we have a smeltery controller. Uh, why did that not... Ah, because it wants us to get lava first. Okay, got ya. Let's make a few more buckets, actually, thinking about it. Because we're going to get four lava from that. And, in fact, what we can do... Let's make one of these right now. Was that a task? I mean, there's, okay. <laughs> what we'll do is we'll go grab a bucket of lava, which is this way, when we can. Yeah, and then uh, with that lava, we can put it in the tank and we can start setting up a tinker smeltery. So I'm gonna be back when this is finished. And there we go, got a bucket of lava. So that now means we can make a cobble gen, which is amazing. We can also do this, and it will complete these here. Oh, it does want us to make a shoot. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of these torches. Oh, all of these have got a bucket now. That's good. Uh, yeah, because what I'm going to do is dig this up. Uh, I don't know if lava affects snow in any way but yeah if we chuck that down uh, we kind of don't need that anymore that is kind of a trash can as well that's good to know so we can grab this out uh i did use my buckets already because uh where is it right here yeah what i wanted to do is let's get that there's my gravel over here. That. And then I need half a stack of this. Because with this, what we can do is if we take the water bucket, stick in some clay, and then I think it's like this. And I'm looking for this right here. Okay, that's the way it is. Okay, that makes sense. So I can now make some concrete. Love to be able to set an auto craft up for this and just fill this with water buckets. Uh, but now we've got this. We can this way. Yeah, it's over here. I think all of these are empty except this corner one. Yeah. So we should be able to grab these and make sure they don't go in the lava. <laughs> I mean, we have enough of them, so it's fine. There we go. Now we can put some andesite in there. I was going to make a, um, what do you call it? A resource generator for these, but 
I think I'm going to do it by hand for now, just because, yeah, we don't need that much to begin with. But the other stuff we need is, we need some more copper, so we can make the opposite type, like this, and that makes a shoot. I don't think I'm going to use the shoot, but we can mount that down again, I think, yeah. So that would just get us back. Yeah, the, the uh, stuff that we have in here. What else does this want? It just, okay, just want some more, more of these bricks. So there you go, there's 64. Wait a minute. Is there a seared brick singularity? No, no, that was just wishful thinking right there. <laughs> by putting a two by uh, sorry a three by three base it's here bricks and four walls outside okay that's just teaching us how to do this okay how do we make osmium then because that is the next quest right tick and then oh okay so we take the carbon nanotubes some iron and that'll do and that will make us osmium. We don't actually have iron yet, so we kind of need to go down the create. Where do we want to build this as well? Let's let's have a look. I'm thinking maybe we build it out here. Hmm. I mean, what we could do, oh, yeah, there we go. What we could do is maybe build it into this wall here. I think that that will look pretty good. I like having my um, smelteries uh, sort of two by two, right? Because that way it's an even number that goes in there. Uh, but I could do a four by four. So move these. Yeah, yeah, I like this idea. Let's get my hammer. I swear I had a hammer. What's it called in this? A smasher. Ooh. Can I repair this? There we go. So let's just hammer this out a little bit. So there we go. We've got a working smeltery right there. Uh, I didn't put any lava in it yet, so I don't think... Yeah, it's not going to do damage yet. What I am going to do is I probably will go up... Yeah, that's a point. Let me go up one more. So right here. That is just because then I can get a whole stack of items in here. I do it this way. These are probably all landed straight in this smeltery. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> Take all of that out. Uh, I might need a few more of these seared bricks though. But I think that is fine. So I'm just smelting up some more smeltery bricks. Uh, but in the meantime, I can put some lava in this. And what I've done is I stuck the heater and the melter in there already. And then with that, what I can do is plot this down. Ooh, yeah, I do need to... Yeah, I need to grab a few bricks just quickly. Just so I can fill this in. So now that makes a, a solid, yeah, solid row right there. We'll stick this like this. Ah, but we don't have an ingot cast. But what we can do is this. And that'll delete the cast every time. So how many seared bricks have we got? Four blocks. Hmm, okay, so that's... Well, we can, we can put that back now. So yeah, I'm just going to get all of these out of here. That's a lot, actually. We might need some more sand.
Yeah, there it is. Let's just get like a bunch of it. There we go. In fact, what we can do... I don't have any hoppers. Okay. I want at least three. There we go. And then I'll also get uh, just a normal chest will do. Maybe a, yeah, one of these chests. That looks good. So with this, I can chuck the chest there. Get a hopper to go here. Stick a hopper on each side. Ah, yeah, that's a point. So if we do that, that'll put that in. I do that, will that put that in? It will not. I swear that used to be a thing. You can right click it every time. Shame. Oh well. Well we can do that. Uh, and then we kind of need a redstone signal of some sort, so a lever would be pretty good. Can you do a blackstone? No. In that case, we kind of need to get a cobble gen up and running. Okay, let's let's get that going. So we haven't put anything in in these yet. Which one was it? It was this. Let's grab like some andesite, and then I can pop back out here, other side. Ah, so I was trying to do an infinite, you know, the cobble gen thing. And I put them the wrong way around. I think you're supposed to put the water here and then lava the other side. Uh, but that does mean we've got obsidian now, which is pretty good. Oh, poop. Let's pick that up. That's because it was flowing, I think. Unless I've completely forgotten how this works. Oh, well, we'll pick this up. I'll get the other bucket. There you go, there's two obsidian though. Just pretend like that's what I was trying to make. I thought it would be here. <laughs> oh wow. Right, let's mine that. It is dark now, so maybe I should go sleep. So there's cobble. Um, so yeah, uh, what is it for a cobble? Uh, what's it called? Singularity. Because one twenty-eight. Okay, sweet. Ooh, Enderman. Yes, please. See, they always give ender pearls. I'm not sure if it's to do with the, the sword that I'm using or something. And I'm not complaining. That's pretty awesome. But I thought I was cheating somehow. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to have to stay here until I get... What, two stacks? Yeah, two stacks of cobble. It's mining away. And then I can make the singularity and we can rip this down. So I will be back in a bit. And there we go, we've got two stacks, so we can go make. Oh yeah, I was making another andesite one. Now we've got a copper one. Hey! <laughs> uh, I'm going to need to make another generator for this, definitely. But that does mean that we can get rid of this now. So I'm going to pick the lava back up. You can store it in these, by the way, so that's what I'm going to do. Uh, yeah, let's take the water back over. And 
we got that right here. Not sure if pods will spread. It might not do. If it doesn't, that's fine. I could just grow another tree here. Yeah, that's that's okay. Cool. So we can just stick that in there for now. Uh, I'm gonna go make a new resource generator for this, and then I'll be back in a sec. There we go. I've got that set up now. So cobble gen going into this. Uh, I was going to make a trash can which is eight cobble so let's grab that I'll cook three of these up and I will make a, a trash can because I think that's going to be very useful for us so I'll be back when that's done and there it is there's the trash can so we can now get rid of stuff like that just by chucking it in there so I did chuck some of this out here just get rid of that we don't need that trap door because I have an extra one in there. Uh, we were going to use this, but I'm just going to get rid of it just to prove that we can. And I did notice our food is getting quite low, so I'm going to start eating stuff. So this kebab thing. Oh. Yeah, that gave us poison. Filled us up though, so that's pretty good. Uh... Oh sweet, it actually shows the stuff in there. <laughs> Didn't notice that before. Awesome. So I'm going to get the crap food first, so these two. I'm only running out here so I can fight stuff, so then I can... Get in the chunk, just in case. Ooh, why are those got sparkles? They've all got sparkles, what the heck? Never know, might need spider's eyes for something. Yeah, um, now we've got those two down. Extra food. Extra food. Oh, okay, that didn't fill us up, but... Didn't get us extra hearts, is what I meant to say. Right, where to go next? Let's have a look at the quests again. So now it wants us to make nine smooth stone for some reason. There's a chapter in section four called The Slaughterhouse which has a subsection for tools you might find useful in making a decent starter mob farm. Ooh. Ooh, okay. And it wants to make us slabs. Fair enough. Right, let's, uh, let's grab a bunch of cobble then and let's cook that up. And there we go, we've got some stone. Uh, what was it saying next? Stone slab for some reason. Oh, because it wants us to make, yeah, that makes sense. So let's make, see if we can make six of these. But hey. How do we pipe stuff in this? Yeah, because to get to mechanical pipes, we need steel. Um... Is there no like other, there's no pipes in this, uh, what else? Immersive has got a fluid pipe, that's iron though. Item pipe from Quark, doesn't have a recipe, disabled, okay. Ooh, that might work. No, but then how... Yeah, yeah, that would work, yeah. 
Uh, okay, let's let's try copper plates. Oh, what was that? Smoosha with copper ingot makes copper plate. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Let's get some copper, which is right here. Yes. Okay, so let's keep three of these. Make some copper plates like this. That's from create. Ah, okay. Use for moving fluids around. Needs a mechanical pump. Oh. Uh, oh, okay. So, can connect to fluid containers such as tanks or basins. Right, okay. Ah. Uh, my bad. I thought it was like the immersive. Uh, but yeah, we can't really do anything with these yet. Because ideally what we do is we'd stick it down. Have the crucible. Oh, other side. Crucible, which is right here. And then we can pump out of it. Oh well, worth a try. Just trying to think of a way to automate this. I did have to make some more room, so yeah, we are pretty drastically full on this. <laughs> what do I need to make one of these? Gold? Oh, we need one of these as well, then, which means we need iron. Okay, we're a little bit away from doing that. Anyway, let's stop being lazy and actually just go set these up like this and then I can just, I don't know, put half a stack in each. Yeah, that'll do it. So these all melt down now pretty quickly and what I can do is set these out like this. Because I believe the next thing it wants us to do is to get eight netherrack, which is fine because we do have lots of redstone now. So I'm just gonna again, oh, well, I can show you what I'm doing right here. And that into netherrack. And this is how we get gold. So we can actually make like pulverizers and stuff. So, as I said, I'm just going to wait for these to fill up, and then I'll get eight, yeah, eight netherrack. I might go nine netherrack, because then I can crush it down and put it through the other thingy, and then, yeah, that's how we get gold. Oh, we're going to need a ton of this, though. I think we might have to switch gears a little bit. We do have to switch gears because we need to get to iron. Okay, let's uh, let's go and have a look at that. So that will be in the create quest line. So this one here. Okay, that's that's one quest line. Let's we can do this one here. Right, I'm gonna go and. Set a few things up and then I will be right back. Uh, there is the netherrack that we were looking for. Might have one more right here. So we can crush this up now and see if we can actually get anything from this. Oh, wrong hammer. Crushed netherrack. Wait a minute. This cannot go through. Yeah, it has to go through the iron. Okay, so we are actually stuck at this point. That's good to know. So let's get started on a few of these then. So let's go for large cog. We can do that. Make double of this. Uh, wait. And there's the small cog. 
all the other things that we needed. So, and it's like casing, shaft. Let's make nickel plates, which then we need a propeller. Is that all of these? Oh, and it wants us to make a wrench eventually, though. So let's just bookmark it for now. So. Grab one of these, I know we need that. We also need some nickel. Uh, this nickel? Yeah. So we can swoosh this to get four, was it? Yeah. And then what is it for this? Three. Nice one. So, done this, done this. That now, shaft we can do. Done that, we can make a propeller. And we can also make a wrench. Lovely. That was really quick. Let's also make some of these. Oh, I need one more nickel plate. And there's the goggles. So let's put those on. I think you can put them on. Can you not put them on as a curio? They are not a curio. Okay. Put them on like that instead. Uh, you can go in here for now. Ye old crank. Okay, we can make one of those as well. It's a hand crank, right? Yeah, so we can hand crank that. It's pretty funny. Next it wants a water wheel. Cased fan. And we might go down this route as well. So, compass. There is some water wheels. Cased fan. Compass. Oh, we got rid of the redstone we had, so that's fine. Two compasses. That makes a speedometer. Uh, we need two of those. It's two of them. And then we just put one in to turn it into a stressometer. Cool, so that's that whole bottom bit done. Uh, yeah, these are the gearboxes. Okay. So they are saying if we want to get some kelp, which is what you use to make like the, the belts and stuff, mechanical belts, you need to waterlog your sieve. Uh, we are going to do that in a bit, but first, let's have a look at the other thing. So we want to do a gearbox, which we can do. And a vertical one as well, which is like that. So that is the... These things, I'm not going to read these. Just going to guess. Oh, okay, maybe I do have to read these. I'll be back in a sec. Okay, I think this is what I've come up with. I did break the wall. I kind of wanted to hide this. I uh, I broke in there with the uh, trapdoor, so I did this bottom one, and I was going to snake in, you know, and then I broke this top one here. So I stood up in there, so I couldn't get out. Bit of a pain, but it's fine. I'm going to pretend like it was... 
I was trying to show you guys what I'm doing. I am using quite a bit of these uh, gearboxes, to be fair. So I've got a gearbox which is connected to these two water wheels right here. This water wheel is basically what we've got here. So they're, they're going around that way. You've got to make sure that they are... Oh, I'm in the water. Yeah, you've got to make sure they're in the right direction. So if you place them on this side, you see the blades. The blades are like this way. Uh, they'll be the other way if you place it on this side. So I place both of them facing this direction. Then I did the other thing that it said in the quest book or showed off. Which is something like this. I even used use some glass look. So, <laughs> uh, But what we can do with this now is if we grab a stack of gravel, go down again. That should be now turning into, well it's being washed. We should get a couple of nuggets and some flint as well which would be nice. I'm going to wait for this to change and then I'll be back. And there we go. It's, uh, uh, we are being pushed back, as you can see. Why can I not get out of this now? Um, <laughs> sorry, glass. Oh, I, did, I forgot that was in this. Oh, that's fine. We've got some more glass here. Let's check that there. Uh, we could do the other things that they were suggesting, which is uh, a scroll up here. Yeah, they've got a gravel, what do you call it, here. A gravel uh, singularity generator thing. One of these. And that's just going in there and washing it over and over. But what we can do, I think we figured this out a little while ago, is we can... Take some wikidium. Is it dust? In here. No, it is the chunks. Yeah, perfect. So we can do something like this. And that'll get us six iron. We turn those into chunks, put it back in here. And you guessed it, we're going to go for the strip singularity straight away. And there it is. Whoa. Uh, let's test if we can do that first, so... Iron! Base the rainbow. Yes, you can, you can turn it back into that, so yeah, I'm just going to keep doing this. And how many iron do we need for this? It was 160. Cool. Right, I'll go off and get 160, which I think is two and a half stacks of iron. And I'll be back with the Singularity. This feels like we're making like lots of progress. I like this in a pack. So back in a bit. In fact, that looks like it's kind of the end of the episode, unfortunately. Uh, I will get this iron between episodes, I swear. And we'll get it up and running. I'm not feeling 100% today. I've had a bit of a head cold. It's not the uh, the thing that's going around, if you know what I mean. It's uh, just a regular old head cold, so I have been tested and everything. But yeah, if uh, between episodes I'm going to get this iron done and probably continue with a little bit more create, because I, unless that's all it wants us to do, I mean... Obviously, we're going to have to get some kelp. Actually, between episodes, I'll tell you what, I'll try and get all of the quests done in this getting creative quest line. And then we can actually move on with Tinkers, which is funny. And then after that, we can get on with the Immersed. Ooh, and then we can get into getting digital. Ah, that's a point. You can look here. So, yeah. You need gold to get there, so all of these. Uh, these are all optional, but I quite like doing all the optional quests because you get the big da 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 at the end. Anyway, I've rambled enough. Let's uh, end the episode. Thank you for watching. Thanks for joining me. And I will see you in the next one.
Bye. I'm going to quickly eat this cod because it gives us two extra hearts. <laughs>